welcome and welcome back to Lydia Living. Today we're having a bit of a little date day. This was actually a present of mine from my birthday last June. It's the 1st of May today and my birthday is the 3rd of June. So... Support like house, isn't it? Yeah. So we're going to the flight club in Birmingham. We're in the car park now. Um, the issue is, I'm a bad loser, you see, and Jamie's in a foul mood because of the football results recently. So, I'm not sure how today is going to go, but we'll give it give it a shot. I'm okay. He used to be quite good, but then has been, you know, simmered down since we've been uh, in a relationship and go, going to the darts occasionally. What do you mean? You know, at the pubs. Oh yeah, he's going for fraud, don't me. Killer. Yeah, every Friday. But yeah, we shall see. I don't know who's going to win, but it's all about under the pressure, isn't it? <laughs> mm. Yeah, we'll take you with me as, as much as I can. It depends on like the music and how busy it is, whether I'm brave enough to do any recordings. When I was there last time with my friends, they actually sent us the clips of the celebrations and stuff via email so i'm not sure whether that will come automatically to jamie's booking afterwards we'll see um but it'll be rubbish to just see me upset the whole time but we'll see we'll see how it goes and then for lunch not sure what we're going to get um i am hungry but the prices in flight club are quite you know, spenny for what we want to do. So we'll have a look at the menu, see if anyone else is like eating something nice around us and whether that's what we want to do. Um, but if not, there's a Tesco's nearby, so we'll probably just pick something up before we get home. One left to become a killer. This is where it gets really dangerous. We're both killers. No. You actually wiped me out. Are you being serious? No, you did. You wiped me out. Jamie's just said he never played snakes and ladders as a child. He's played, played football all day. What? He's played football all day. What about school? Learning maths? It explains a lot. <laughs> right, last game. We're going to do winner takes all because I've let Jamie win quite a few of these now because he's been crying about Spurs for the last three weeks. Not a bad start. Good win it. Another 28, yep. Seven. Go on, seven. Bust. Look how close. I needed a single 19. That's unfair. Right, we both got 16, 14. Happy Got the 
Bingo. Just when the player final when it takes it off. How do you feel? So, if we hadn't have played the winner takes all, he would have won. But that's what you do. If he's a getting betting man, he's willing to risk it all, Ernie. Yeah. Got to be done in it. So we just popped to Tesco and got the crispy crackers, as you saw. We're going to have the like Nutella one now, and then the coronation ones for lunch tomorrow maybe and then yeah for dinner we're just gonna make some homemade nachos my favorite someone please tell me why car parks are still so disgusting well as you saw overall jamie would have won but we did a winner takes it all round and She's your winner. Demolition Queen. They're the only ones I really won, really. <laughs> but yeah, we're just gonna have our crispy creme now, the Nutella one. So let me just get it out. We don't have crispy cremes often because you know they are yeah, spenny. We're just moaning about but, prices, then we just bought a donut. Yeah, no. But on club card, you know? No, it wasn't even on club card. Now I've got a point though. We'll be able to have a free dinner soon. <laughs> Right, I'll have the first one. It's my birthday. Mmm. Want some? Mmm. No, it's nice. Nutella's always nice though. Oh no, you dropped it everywhere. Nice. Mmm. Mm. Very messy, but tasty. You get a lot of Nutella in it, thank goodness, <laughs> for the price. Okay. Right. We're just going to go home now, and Jim is going to try and put the washing line up, which should be good because, you know, it is spring apparently, it's supposed to be warm. We can dry the clothes, save the electricity. So we're hoping we can have the rest of that. We're hoping to get that up now. Um, we're not very DIY savvy. So we'll see. See how well we get on. And um, we'll keep an eye on the championship goals as well. Mm. <laughs> this is going to go one or two ways. She's going to watch nice little bit of audience yeah you reckon that's staying ta-da yeah, didn't think about that. It's well goopy. Surely it's got a lock. No. no. Surely. So you have to tie it around there and then it's more secure. But obviously, oh, duh. Nearly snapped it. Don't break it. So I've done half chilli heat wave half what's it cool ridge. yeah cooler ridge and then mix them up and then do your cheese and then mix it mix it mix it mix it and then more cheese and that is one then in the microwave course. for one minute ten and then you dress it so i'm just finishing the dressing now don't come at me for the double dip because we're only eating it together but usually this would be a major major no-no Boosh. Mm. 
Ooh, boosh. Perfect. If I do say so myself. Oh. What? Yeah. No? You need a trip? <laughs> oh, I was recording. That's going to have a good reaction. <laughs> um, what I was going to come on here and say is, if anyone's got any good short series that we can binge, please leave it in the comments. Oh. Because we've watched all the way up to date with any turkey vlogs for our holiday which isn't even in until august so at least in may when people start going on holiday we'll get some new ones hopefully um and then in terms of other things like we don't have netflix anymore um so it's got to be like iplayer itv anything like channel four things like that so please just let us know because we're getting a bit bored to be honest delicious i literally used to live off nachos at uni like it got to a point where i had to completely ban it from a weekly shop because they were life but yeah we've just settled eating this watching bargain loving brits abroad if you don't know get to know because it's just tv gold and it makes you want to go on holiday Good morning, it's Tuesday and I'm just about to go to work so it's bright and early, it's just after seven or something like that and yeah I'm actually in my gym clothes because I'm going to go straight to the gym from work today and then all being well go swimming afterwards so here's my little bag. So I actually got this bag so I got sent this last year I'm not sure, it was like at the start of, it was near my birthday, so I didn't know whether it was a birthday thing or it was in conjunction with Pride. But I got sent it from Gymshark along with a little um, poster for like Pride and everything like that. It's really nice, let me try and find it for you because it's really nice and some socks. This is what it is, look. Look at the diversity on that poster. So yeah, that's by our caricature in the kitchen <laughs> um but yeah i got sent that last year don't know why i got sent it but really really appreciative because it's now my swim bag can keep everything like all the wet stuff in there afterwards and i also keep um like my wrist straps and my oh what are they called oh you know the resistant my resistance bands and my locker for the key um, no, the key for the locker that way around so I keep all things gym in there and I just grab it and I know it's ready every single week when I go swimming or when I go to the gym and that's a bit more of a session rather than just popping by in the gym um, so yeah that's what I'm wearing of course it's spring now so the trench is out um, and I'm just wearing my gym clothes so that I can change straight into them um, straight after work this afternoon so yeah, that was a good little session. I've definitely cooled down. I'm not as red as I usually am. And that's purely because at the end I sat and started talking about like my my food goals and things like that. Because I do want and need to lose a certain amount of weight um, just for gen general health. Like I am, I'm happy in myself and don't like talk negatively to myself or anything like that but you know some things need to be done so i would like to get i've got personal targets which i won't share because they are personal to me um but i need to start actually committing stuff to myself because it's all well and good doing all of this fitness and exercising and stuff like that but i need to pair it up with the most important nutrients really um but it's just so easy. I'm a lazy eater. I'm a convenience eater. I'm a proper little foodie. I love my food. Um, so, and I, I think I'm going to get myself a little food diary and plan like two weeks at a time around my social life, not planning food and then realising I've got things on. Whereas we all know if you're busy, that's when 
you neglect your food choices you grab things just because it's it's quick and easy or it's what's available and by not having like good full meals that's when you're more likely to snack in between and just like pick 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 which is definitely what i do but yeah it's wednesday so i am now off to do the double exercise which is swimming with my dad um so yeah the next time you see me it will be darker the hair will be rather than it looks greasy it is a little bit greasy from working out but it also had hairspray in it for the past two days for work um so it will just be a nice tired lydia and then after that on the way home i need to get petrol so i'm going to stop in at asda and get a few fresh bits for the last couple of days at work hey guys so i totally forgot to record after swimming and as always swimming makes me exhausted so didn't really do much when we got home and i've just woke up it's lovely it's light in the mornings when i'm waking up now so i'm gonna finish the video here with my lovely bed head look and I'll, I think I'll show you next weekend as well because I've got a few things planned, really excited things planned in May. So I think we'll have a few things that you might enjoy watching. Um, then maybe, yeah, after that vlog, I'm not sure. Um, we're trying to do bits to the garden, so you might see things gradually improving for the garden. Um, other than that just little updates here and there um in june you may have a little holiday vlog um which i know i'm my most popular on here which is the same as what i watch on youtube to be fair so i don't blame you but yeah i will finish this vlog here thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time